Hey guys, thanks for watching. Last time I started the uh, series about abdominal core training, we talked about why not to do the abdominal crunch because of that rounding of the back. I'm going to show you the first in a progression of moves that's harder, but that'll train your core while working your transverse abdominis, your obliques, but your lower back as well. Not feeding into that muscle imbalance where your front section is going to be, your front side is going to be stronger than your back side, and that's going to lead to a muscle imbalance and probably an injury. Um, so what we're going to do is we're going to train both sides using what's called anti-flexion, anti-rotational movements. The first move is a plank. It's very, very simple and easy. What you're doing is you're using your abdominals and your lower back and your whole trunk to prevent yourself from falling to the ground. So we're not creating movement like we were doing with the crunch. That is creating movement. What we're doing is we're tightening our muscles to prevent movement. So here's how it works. With the plank, you're going to want to get a nice parallel arm. Match up this arm. Try to keep it straight underneath your shoulder for, for good stability. And you're going to get up on your toes. Your bum's not going to be high up in the air, nor is it going to be sagging. Because you can just imagine the tension that's putting on my lower back. What you want to do is you want to be straight like a table. Keep your legs relatively flexed, and you're going to feel this in your abdominals pretty soon. Try to keep yourself nice and low, and if you start drifting up or drifting down, have a training partner or have your mirror there to check to make sure that you're nice and straight. A lot of people get into this move by clasping their arms together. Uh, this is like an oh crap, I'm going to fall over movement. Don't start yourself on the easiest progression. Start yourself here. Keep yourself nice and taut, nice and straight. Focus on contracting those abdominals and keep them nice and still. Then when you start getting wavery, when you start twitching and you don't know what you're gonna stop, then try to hold on to here for one last little bit. But focus on keeping nice and straight. Somebody could be able to put a little ball on your lower back and it wouldn't move. Nice and straight. And that's the plank.